Okay, hello everyone, it's Kiki and today I'm gonna make a music video but before starting up with the video I have a message for my Italian viewers Ciao a tutti uh, Il video di oggi so che farà dispiacere a qualcuno perché è in inglese ma è facile da seguire perché parlerò delle mie band preferite e mostrerò un po' di cd quindi se vi va guardatelo e vi prometto che il prossimo video sarà uh, quello che avevo promesso sulle tisane, sui tè, sui caffè quindi um, prometto che il prossimo sarà in italiano, grazie Hello again, as I was saying um, I'm recording with my new microphone Baba, the blue microphone and I hope you cannot hear the fan of my laptop actually I'm recording with two laptops today, um, the first one for the video part and the other one for the audio part and um, I would like to show you but maybe I will post a picture later um, okay so I took inspiration for this video from my friend Drunken Nature Isamar who did a fantastic video where he showed his favorite albums and he talked about the music he likes and I thought that would be interesting if I did something similar um, as many of you know uh, from my style, the way I look, the way I uh, post music on Facebook um, I mostly listen to black metal, death metal, trash metal um, I love metal and um, hardcore, punk, grunge I love every kind of music really, especially classical music but I'm especially fond of metal and um, so, um, I'm saying this with no pride whatsoever Most of the CDs that I'm gonna show you today uh, belong to my childhood and adolescence or are my brothers because um, at a certain point when the internet popped up I stopped buying CDs completely and as a result most of my favorite bands, the ones that I listen to right now um, I listen online so I'm gonna talk about them at the end of the video so that you can check them out and see if they're, they're something of your taste but I'm sorry about that I would like to buy CDs right now but I just can't okay so first of all I'm gonna start with two bands that I like because I know someone that plays in it in them um, first one, I hope it's okay if I mention them but it's advertising right? so it's good for the band the first one is My Darkest Side they're from Rome and my friend doesn't play in them anymore but they make some good death metal music so check them out, they perform live and the other one is Iconoclast and they are yeah, thrash death metal and I really love their music, they're good and they actually play uh, in Europe um, they're really good good music, check them out okay so this one instead it's a gift that I received from a friend who knows very much about music and it's Tiamat, Death Metal Clouds 2012 remastered, it's a very nice album and I love the cover with roses and Scarecrows, Scarecrosses is really nice. Okay, so this is a piece of history because it's not music, but this is the CD that triggered my SMR for the first time. I found it in a magazine and um, it's called Dormire, which in Italian means sleeping, and it had 30 minutes of exercises and that gave me ASMR before even knowing about ASMR oh there's the CD inside I'm glad okay so oh this was my brother's children of bottom follow the reaper yes it's definitely my brother's I never listened to children of bottom until up until I was 17 or 18 and this was from nuclear blast 2001 pretty good okay so this is temple of the dog this is not metal it's grunge and rock and 
Um, actually, I loved the first song, Say Hello to Heaven, performed by Soundgarden, I think. It was for someone who died. Yeah, and uh, it's a pretty nice bouquet of uh, different songs from different bands and Temple of the Dog was a nice project. Very nice. And the date is 1991. I was one year old. Oh my. Okay, oh, the world needs a hero, Megadeth. I really loved Disconnect. The world needs a hero, uh, 1000 times goodbye was my favorite song back when I was 11, I think. Yeah, 2001. I was buying metal CDs back when I when I was 11. It's pretty cool, right? Okay, Rhapsody. I know many metal heads do, do not love Rhapsody. Down of Victory, but this is history. And what kind of childhood did you have if you didn't listen to Rhapsody? I mean, no. Wow, and it's... Um, the creepy fact is that the cover is Rhapsody, but the body is Avantasia, the metal opera, which was one of my favorite CDs. Um, favorite CDs of my adolescence. Good lord, I don't know why this college, but... Collage. Nightwish, this was my brother's wishmaster. I never really liked Nightwish because I don't like high-pitched lyrical voices in women. I like deep, um, low voices, but they are a good band, so I'm not complaining. Okay, Eyes Adrift. As many of you know, I loved Nirvana and in the desperate need to find something similar to Nirvana, I bought Eyes Adrift's album where Chris Novoselic played and um, there's Kurt Kirkwood of Meat Puppets but okay it's not a bad album but nothing to do with Nirvana whatsoever mm -mm. I didn't really like it okay then Iron Maiden, The Number of the Beast this was my brothers Invaders, Children of the Damned, The Prisoner Number of the Beast, Total Eclipse, Salute by the Name yeah, um, what can I say about Iron Maiden? Uh, yeah, a classical band, um, but I never really liked them that much. And I know this is an heresy, but um, most of the popular band that people want and like, I don't really find myself wanting them as bad as people want them. Except for Nirvana, In Utero. And this was one of my favorite albums, actually. I have everything everything about Nirvana. And I liked the fetus creepy thing here that they made. Such great songs, Scentless Apprentice, Hardship Box, Read Me, Friends of Home, Whatever, Range on Seattle. Oh, good lord. <laughs> it makes me oh, all tingly just looking at them. Oh, well, Evanescence. Fallen. What can I say about this album? I bought it because I was a teenager, okay? Don't make fun of me. Um, insist decide. What can I say about this album? This is great. I mean, I love Nirvana. As much as people come to me and say, Kiara, why do you listen to Nirvana? I mean, black metal, death metal, grind and stuff. I love Nirvana. It's like the first love, something deeper than me. Something, um, some inner wisdom, you know? It's kind of, I don't know, feeling. <laughs> what can I say? Bleach by Nirvana. This is their first album. And it's great, I mean, I, I don't have anything else to say about Nirvana, this album was great, the lyrics were great, I mean, Floyd the Barber is such a great song, you know, Bell on a door ring, come on in, Floyd observes my origin, I mean, no, 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 this is great, great, okay, and Unplugged in New York, Penny Royalty, my god. 
Tell me, where did you sleep last night? The man who sold the world, come as you are, but a girl, everything unplugged. What else? What do you want? I mean, this is ah, great. Mm. This is Futurama. Is it called Futurama in, in English? Yeah. Off topic, sorry. I wanted this to be spontaneous, so I didn't check the CDs before taking them. Metallica and Justice for All. Oh, Black Hand and Justice for All. I have the Beholder one. I mean, what do you want to say about Metallica? Metallica is a classical group, but I, I really love, love Metallica. They were my first um, love, and I really love to play their songs with my guitar. So yeah, I guess the Iron Maiden thing doesn't apply to Metallica. Mm, in Italy we say, question the feeling, feeling, feeling matters, yeah. Oh, this is a mp3 compilation, a perfect circle, ACDC, Audio Slave, Coldplay, David Bowie. I mean, I had a good taste. Lou Reed, Oasis, Pearl Jam, Placebo, Rancid, The Clash, The Who, Pink Floyd, Grateful Dead. Nice. Oh, Stormlord. It's an Italian band, Supreme Art of War. This was my brother's, I guess. Yeah. And Foo Fighters, one by one. I guess I had this kind of Nirvana obsession that drove me to Dave Grohl and Chris Novoselic. Novoselic. What? What is it? Yeah. Yeah, Foo Fighters. Not bad, but not great. Okay, then. Let's see what I've got here. <coughs> These are my CDs with some of my bro brothers, but okay, His Infernal Majesty that I'm wearing the t-shirt right now. You want to say that I love Bill Valo because he's good looking? Yes. Hell yeah. Love metal. Funeral arts. I know, this is my emo side. What can I say? Buried. I love my love. Loves the funeral of arts. And okay. Star Wars? No. Marilyn Manson, The Golden Age of Grotesque. I'm sorry, um, Drunken Nature ASMR. If you're watching this video, you're so precise and clean, but my CDs are uh, thrown away like. I don't know, yeah. I'm really a bad person. Cover no. Let's see what I got here. Cause oh, I guess I can make some scratching sounds. Do you like it? Am I scratching the hell out of you? Yeah, I'm very comical today, if you're not noticing. The calling, Camino Palmero. I had a huge crush on this guy here, the singer Alex Band, because I, I don't know, I was a very passionate girl. <laughs> so... Red Hot Chili Peppers Red Hot Chili Peppers Greatest Hits Why not? Under the Bridge, Give It Away Californication, Scar Tissue, Soul to Squeeze Other Side, Suck My Kiss By The Way, Parallel Universe, Breaking The Girl, My Friend, Higher Ground, Universally Speaking And uh, uh, yeah, very nice even though I never really loved Red Hot Chili Peppers, you know, this is the difference. Right now, I only listen to bands that I really enjoy. Back then, I used to buy CDs of bands that I didn't even listen to. Oh... <laughs> this is the Black Album by Metallica with a Nirvana CD in it. Things that happen in my house. 
Okay, Black Album by Metallica bought it in 1998 and it was, or nine, yeah, 1998 or 1999. I can't remember, for God's sake. I was in America, but. 1998, I think, yeah. And okay, this is Nirvana, Nirvana's album, you know you're right. Yeah. I have some guitar strings, Fender strings, actually useful. I'm glad I did this video, otherwise I... <laughs> I would not find the strings. Oh, another delicacy. Nirvana, you know your right album with Dream Theater in it. <laughs> Since from a memory. Live in New York. I wonder why I did that. You know, breaking CDs and putting other stuff in it. Okay. Man of War. Oh god. Oh, look at them. Look at them. Look at the furry underpants. Oh my god. I mean, they had such a amazing style into Glory Ride. I mean, okay, you cannot possibly have an, a lovely childhood if you didn't listen to Man of War. Please. I mean, this is religion. This is basics. From the muddy banks of the Wiska. 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 Nirvana. How great. Ah, uh, yeah. And inside, yeah, we have the, the real CD. Oh, thank Lord. Thank Lord. Sorry. Stratovarius. Infinite. This was my brother's, I guess. Not bad. The doors. This is mine. Essential rarities. And there's Hello to City, Break on Through. I mean, I love the doors. Hello, I love you. Hello, I love you. Want to tell me your name? The end. This is the end. No, 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 my only friend, the end. <laughs> Sorry, I get so, like, happy when I talk about music. I didn't realize that. Sex Pistols, Kiss This, oh god. Oh my god, this is amazing. Anarchy in the UK, God Save the Queen, Pretty Vic and Holidays in the Sun. Oh, this is great. Kiss this. And never mind the bullets too. I have it somewhere here. It's gonna pop up. This is an Italian band, but who cares? Never mind bollocks. Here it is. I mean this was such a classical when I started playing guitar. Holidays in the sun, bodies, no feelings, liar, God save the queen, problem seventeen. Anarchy in the case of mission, pretty vacant New York. Am I? No. Slipknot. Oh, live. This this was great. Actually, one of the last CDs I bought, and I love the Slipknot. Even though everyone hates them, I love them. I mean, pretty good. But blister exists. Disaster piece. Before I forget. Vermilion. She seems dressed in all of me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, Vermilion Part 2 is amazing. Okay, the Golden Age of Grotesque, but since the city was without a cover. Oh, no, there's nothing inside. Good. What was it? Okay, I'm gonna find it later. Sorry, you guys. Okay. Actually, look at this monkey. Look at her. Look at her. Haha. <laughs> well, what can I say about this album? Probably the one that I'll, I've loved the most. 
my first love, the, the album where I fell in love with the music, where I opened myself, I surrendered to music. What can I say about it? It's great, it's amazing. And oh, and I'm out of the States. Look at this, look at how broken it is. And yeah, I mean, what, what can you say to Blink 182? I mean, they're part of our childhood is if we were born in 1990 and uh, don't leave me all alone all the small sayings, Adam's song, I mean, come on, this is classical oh, and offspring America, Americana Welcome, pretty fly, the kids aren't alright. I mean this too is a classical piece of music. Linkin Park oh. This is a great CD, The Cult Love. This is great. Brother Wolf and Sister Moon, it's a great band. Really listen to this particular album with you know, in the cover you can see all the Latin American symbols. It's pretty fantastic, really. Guano Hapes. What's this? Alternative rock. I was pretty interesting teenager. And yeah, those are pretty much... There are some missing, but... Yeah, these are the, ob the albums I wanted to show you. And right now I'm going to talk about the bands that I listen to right now. So I'm very fond of a particular music gene that is called Witch House. And while talking about Witch House, I'm using my rain stick. Because I wanted to use it in a ASMR video. So um, right now I'm very fond of Witch House um, bands like Crimes, Solemn, um, Rituals, um, then Hardcore Punk, um, DRI. Um, what else? Corrosion of Conformity Grindcore Bands Porn Grind And Black Metal I love like Forgotten Tomb, Bethlehem uh, Silencer Balfagor, Dissection uh, Leviathan um, Pestiferous, Pest Noir um, then Thresh Metal, Holy Moses, Municipal Waste, Pantera, um, what else? My favorites, yeah, Municipal Waste, Municipal Waste, and, um, and then I have a couple of favorites bands that I don't have CDs about um, At the Gates. What else? Let me think. Something that I really enjoy. Um, mostly underground bands. And I'm discovering right now some grindcore bands with deceased names. You know, like deceased names like the, um, I don't know, Chronicle, uh, Bowel Syndrome, or stuff like that. It's pretty nice, and they have just like vocals, very sharp and and almost like pigs um, singing, like like that. And they are really great. I know it's the kind of music that I really enjoy li listening live in a live performance. And then what else am I forgetting? I'm sure I'm forgetting about something. Yes, there are so many amazing bands. There's Ulver and Agalock and 
all this amazing band to make a kind of um, mixed ambient music and it's really great and you know you can um, feel the darkness and some doom music I love a band called Kanan and Neronaya uh, which is like black boredom in English they're Italian they make doom music yes I like doom yeah I was forgetting about doom but it's um, a type of music that I really like like funeral doom and that kind of um, heavy stuff, ambient and most of all, you know, witch house and if you go on YouTube and uh, type witch house uh, so many beautiful bands pop up like mascara um, yes, there was a, um, a song called crystal math it's pretty nice and it's like the type of music you would expect to hear in a um, in a haunted house so just type for example grindcore and so many bands pop up or um, witch house or another thing that I like to do is studying the history of recent music for example I wanted to do more about hardcore punk so I um, did some research and started drawing a map of all the bands and where they were born um, the influences and stuff and I started looking for new bands and I'm crap with names you know <laughs> I love so many bands but I cannot recall some of them some of their songs and albums but if you want to find something interesting and you want to um, build your own opinion just do it I mean go for it you type the type of music that you like or that you want to know something about and then you find new bands okay um, I think this video is very long right now it's 27 minutes oh my okay I hope you enjoyed and uh, this was relaxing enough and you liked the bands that I uh, talked about and if you have some questions I can answer them uh, send me a message on Facebook or on YouTube and I will try and answer and if you have some good bands to um, to uh, share please do so because I really love new music and um, you know it's very difficult to concentrate every band that you like in just a single video for example right now Hypnosia pop up in my head because I love them and I, I'm thinking that I didn't mention them so I don't know it's so vast the world of music is so vast and of course Black Sabbath I mean I love them okay but I want to stop this video right now so please let me know what you think and please share some of your favorite bands with me because I really appreciate that okay so thank you for watching and see you in my next video